the allegations preposterous. A push to stop New Mexico's name game is on the agenda at the state capitol tomorrow. When it comes to tacking names on state buildings, it's not what you've accomplished that's important. It's who you know. News 13 investigative reporter Larry Barker called attention to it late last year. Politicians still in office getting their names on public buildings. Governor Bill Richardson, for example, his name was plastered on the new addition at UNM Hospital while he was in office, as well as the Coors I-40 interchange, the new spaceport runway, even a rail runner train. State Senator Mark Boitano told us last month it's unfair. A bill he's sponsoring would change the way public buildings can be named, and it could get the up or down vote in a Senate committee meeting tomorrow. In the name of an elected official on a public building is 24-7 marketing promotion uh, advertising. And the Senate Rules Committee meets tomorrow morning at 8.30 at the State Capitol in Santa Fe. So far, no arrests as the